You are all gay. You're all lesbian. Every last one of you. You like penis? You like vagina? You like to take it. You like to give it. The question isn't whether you're straight or not, it's which way the pendulum is swinging for you. The work done by Freud, along with Fly, seems to show that we are all born with a predisposition toward bisexuality. And through our development involving internal and external factors, we become monosexual, albeit the bisexuality remains latent. Now most of you know Freud, but let's get into Fleiss. Fleiss had this idea that sexuality was connected to the uh, nose in some way or another. And at first that was kind of put to the side, but modern science has shown a connection between the nose and sexual behavior. So basically saying, you're all gay and it's okay. Feel free to go look it up yourself. The modern uses of the term innate bisexuality is more indicative of Alfred Kinsley. Let's just say he uh, involved himself in a lot of group sex with his students. Now he kind of says that all humans are bisexual to some degree. They just don't express that behavior. And I actually agree with that in some way or another. And all of these people, Kinsley, Freud, Fleiss, they were all kind of weird actually if you look them up. But what can I say? I don't agree with everything they say, but I do agree in the sense that we're all to some degree or another bisexual. So go ahead and leave your gay ass comments and tell me what you think.